Most people, you know, they struggle during meditation for fighting with unwanted thoughts during meditation. Moment you try to attain to a thoughtless state, I was recent, just now listening to a sister before me, how to attain, she was mentioning, come to a thoughtless state. A beautiful goal to have, to arrive at a thoughtless state. How to do it? The day you decide to go to sleep very fast, you will stretch that length of time. You know, oh, I want to sleep as soon as my head falls on the pillow. But more you try, your time before going to sleep will only expand and you will only get frustrated. Trying to stop the brain from thinking will work against us. Because the role of the mind, role of the mind is to think. If you try to suppress it, it will be unnatural. It's like tongue is to taste, eyes are to see. And you tell eyes and tongue not to do their natural functions, <laughs> it will not work. So you can have a thoughtless mind to a certain extent. But God has given us the mind with a purpose to have rightful, wiser thoughts with correct understanding, correct thinking, all this can beautify our life. We have to train the mind in a particular way through a yogic sadhana. And that's what heartfulness is all about. 